Hey creatives, it's Seb here. In today's video, I'm going to show you the best Premiere Pro export settings for your YouTube videos. I'm going to show you the best video and audio export settings for your YouTube videos. And to finish it off, I'm also going to be sharing with you a secret audio setting because if you weren't aware, YouTube will actually cap your video if your levels are peaking or are too loud. So this secret setting is going to be able to push out your videos to a lot more people. Now, just before we get started, if you are new here, welcome. My name's Seb. This channel is about videography, video editing and photography. I'm all about posting high quality short form content. So if that does sound interesting to you, then do consider hitting the subscribe button. But now that we've gotten out of the way, let's jump right into Premiere Pro and start exporting your video. So welcome to the editing desk and welcome to Premiere Pro. So as you can see right here, we just have a basic video clip because we're not gonna be doing anything special. We're just gonna go over to file and go straight into your export settings. Now, before we get into the actual video export settings, I'm gonna be advising you to export your videos in 4K, even if it is shot in 1080 it doesn't really matter because the way YouTube works is as you can see right now on this graph for the recommended bit rates for HDR uploads the 4k has a lot more bit rate MPPS compared to a 1080 one which is only 10 to 15 and the 4k is 44 to 85 so I always upscale my videos even if they are 1080 and to be completely honest with you I don't see any difference but now that we've gotten out of the way let's go ahead and do the video export settings so for this we're going to select the format H point two six four for the preset if you've imported my 4k youtube export settings then you can just import them right here but if you haven't and you're just following along then follow this we're going to go into presets and we're going to go onto youtube 4k ultra hd we're going to be using this as a template from here we're going to go into our video settings and make sure that the width is a 4k aspect ratio so 3840 by 2160 we're going to scroll down until we get to render at maximum depth and just check that we're going to make sure our encoding settings are hardware encoding set to high at 5.2. Keep scrolling until you get to your bitrate settings. So here we have CBR and VBR. So CBR stands for constant bitrate and VBR stands for variable bitrate. Just to shorten it up for you, constant bitrate is going to keep its target bitrate to whatever you set it to. Variable bitrate is going to be a bit more flexible. So if you've got some shots that are at high FPS, it's going to allow more bitrate to that section, which is going to overall make your video look a lot smoother. So for this, we're going to set it to VBR 2 pass and we're going to set our target bitrate to 50 and then we're going to set our maximum bitrate to 80. Once you've done that, you can just select use maximum render quality and then we're done for the video section. Now we're going to head over to the audio, make sure it's set to AAC, make sure your sample rate is 4800 and set to stereo. Make your audio quality high and set your bit rate to 320. Once you've done that, you're good for the audio. Now we're gonna head over to the secret setting so YouTube doesn't penalize you for your audio peaking. To do this, go into your effects and then scroll down until you get to loudness normalization. We're gonna set the loudness standard to ITUBS and then we're gonna set your target loudness to minus 14 your tolerance to zero, and then your max true peak to minus one. So the loudness normalization is gonna cap your video's audio so it meets with YouTube's threshold, and that's gonna allow it to push it to more people within YouTube. Once you've done that, you can just save this as a preset right here, name it whatever you want, and then just press export. So those are the best Premiere Pro export settings for your YouTube videos as of 2021. I hope you did enjoy this video. Don't forget you can download the export settings in the description down below but thanks a lot for watching and i'll see you in the next video